All right, hey, and welcome to the newest edition of Respectful Tournament Times uh, with Will and Angela. So we did a Thursday again this week, and I don't know, what did you think about the way that we approached it? This was pretty, um, in terms of the theme, we got it almost immediately. Will was on a roll in this one. He saw 11 and 17. He saw the salad and a dress one and was like, oh, like, it's AD and it's in the square. Back when I used to live, like, at the dining hall on the dorms on campus, I was known to, like, freshmen that didn't actually know me yet as the guy that always got the gigantic salads every day. So, no wonder! Yeah, you noticed the connection right away to Adblock. Yeah, which... we were like, after we learned from um, Jeffrey Weschler at Lollapazoola that we had to look at the theme immediately, I scanned through the puzzle and looked for the theme and got to Adblock. Um, I think it was... Like, the, the puzzle went pretty smoothly in terms of the theme. We actually got stumped um, at the end. So we, like, filled it out really fast, maybe, like, 20 minutes. And we then were we under spent, 20 minutes. We, I think we were we under were 20 like minutes. something. And we were stumped for a good 10 minutes trying to figure out why we were wrong. And we may have cheated a little bit, but I think that's all fun and games when you're trying to debug <laughs> a puzzle. Hey, they give you Google tickets at the Wall of Pazool tournament. So yeah, we probably burned through at least I have to Google 15 Google like, tickets. Yeah, Mega Man is blue. <laughs> <laughs> the thing that we got wrong, first we had T wrong. So we had um, uh, in the left corner, we had uh, we didn't know how to spell this word. Oh yeah, Areola. I had to ask we were, what we that had meant. Ease, we had we had all kinds of, of fun stuff going on there. Yeah. And it didn't occur to us actually until the puzzle was over that it was number two or six, as in the presidents. And I don't know. I guess that's because both of the atoms kind of suck as presidents. But <laughs> so it doesn't immediately jump to my mind. Oh, I'm just realizing now it's not their first name. It's their last name. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we have Adams as presents. <laughs> really bad. This is what our combined college education is for. Okay, I haven't oh taken gosh. a history class in a while, so uh, that's so, my so we, were, we were stuck on that, and then we were also stuck in the top corner. We had oh, another, I guess, college team. Like we had seminar, and I just kind of like accepted that, yeah. and then... Angela realized at the end that webinar is apparently a thing. I've taken like one or two webinars in my day. I think I had to take one once for this like club I was involved in in high school. I like did this like community uh -huh. service club and I was like the webmaster for <laughs> my like little district. And I think you were head of the point. webs in the webinar. <laughs> oh my god, that's sick. <laughs> I think I had to take the webinar for the webmasters. Oh, I see. I, I see. think webmaster is like a job description that's been like outdated. I've moved but to. But it, it sounds like pretty badass though. A webmaster? Yeah. Like a spider? It's like how like chess will always be kind of cool as long as they keep the phrase like grandmaster. <laughs> I think webmasters are unfortunately defunct now. Oh, that is kind of sad. I know. So we've moved to the more hype data scientist title. No, no, you should be a data master. <laughs> I'm going to rebrand myself as data master Angela Lee. You absolutely should, yeah. Okay, I think that will go yeah. over well. I want to go into my internship tomorrow and tell them I'm a data master. Yeah, let me know how that works. <laughs> I'll be very curious. <laughs> Yeah, did you have a, another particular favorite word in here? or? Well, I thought it was cute how Adopt a Road had 80 at the front and the end. I did like that. I, you know what, I really like this theme. I don't know. Maybe because we got it, so, so maybe when, when we understand the theme pretty easily. It's, <laughs> it's the best like, theme ever. I get to feel really clever and smart. But I don't know, I, I did, I liked how they played with the uh, the blank spaces. Yeah, that was cool. It was kind of fun. Oh, do you notice like the 80s are sort of like spread out 
like symmetrically sort of like in a like yeah that almost thing. spread out like you know a dude on the subway when I'm trying to get to work at 8 30 in the morning with his legs all the way across in a man spread <laughs> wow you transitioned to that yeah. so well Will no that was probably my favorite word because um i just desperately at some point in the city want to like grab some obnoxious stranger's legs that's just like you know taking up three spots in the subway car and just be like but I'll probably get arrested if I do that how would you do that would you go up to them and like squish their legs together like excuse me like kind of like an accordion I don't know (laughs) I feel like you don't have a sense of what New Yorkers will do to you. Oh yeah, I'll die. That'll be, okay. that'll be the end of this this blog. <laughs> will you become part of the undead? Perhaps. <laughs> no more adulting for Will. <laughs> I'm gonna need to drink a couple of IPAs to forget about. <laughs> Do you like how well we're ad living? Yeah, I mean, like, all these puns are pretty adorable, though. (laughs) So, like, I guess it's fine. It's just a carousel of puns. Yeah. (laughs) Oh, wow, this is really becoming such a hassle. (laughs) (laughs) Okay, we can't do this. This cannot be how we run this one. Yeah, I'll let up, I'll let up, it's fine. (laughs) (laughs) Oh my gosh, stop it with this affair. With that, we're going to leave you for another week. We're going to say a dear. Yeah. Respectable tournament times. And yeah. Thank you for tuning in. (laughs) See you next week. (laughs) Bye. Bye.